What's going on? Welcome again to another T-Series Showcase. For today, I have the February BAM Geek Box. Yes, so this is the final BAM box for me for the month, other than actually the BAM Ultra Box that hopefully will come in soon. I'm figuring now it is March, so hopefully. Um, geek, 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 Geek. The franchises were originally uh, Star Trek Hackers. Don't ask me about that one. Um, and Spider-Man, and then they added The Office. So, full disclaimer here, I know nothing about hackers, I know very little about Star Trek, and very, very little about The Office. Spider-Man I got. Spider-Man. So, without further ado, we're gonna get into this one. Uh, expectations for this one are... I don't know where like I, I i got it because i don't regularly skip any of the boxes um so i kind of just get all of them now the thing in this one is that there is a signed uh item so that is uh gonna be pretty sweet um but we're gonna start off per usual with the scratch card there's your instructions right that um so you have to match all three the same symbol to win. Uh, so items you can get are a apparently free band box. Wait. Oh my god. I actually won. I matched all three. That's fantastic. Um... Wow. Okay. So, I actually won. That's never happened before. I won a free band box. That's awesome. I'm gonna have to mail that in. Um, now, obviously, fair warning, I'm doing this before I post the video. So, any of all that, you know, trying to take a screenshot, no. I won. I finally won something. <laughs> Alright. Uh, sorry, Geekbox. You, you just, you, I'm sorry if I said you had low expectations. Thank you. Do not throw that card away. All right, so yeah, you can win a free band box. You can win a flat screen TV, Xbox uh, uh, One X. You can win a PS4, stuff like that. Uh, wow, sorry, that caught me off guard. Uh, can't believe that happened. All right, so next we're gonna do the BAM Geek card. So this is BAM Geek. Congratulations, this is an authentic BAM fan art card featuring a unique sketch from one of our featured Artist Alley artists. This is part of this year's Villain series. Featured artist of this one is Othel Flowers, uh, number 702 out of 2,500. Othel was also the one in the... What box? Gamer box, I believe? Yeah. So, here we go. One, two, three. Shredder! Okay. Not bad. Shredder's pretty cool. It's actually a really cool uh, artwork you got going on there, too. Um... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I do like them. I do have a signed Leonardo Pop there, that one. Uh, and that's signed by, um, name escaping me, Kevin Eastman. Wow, I was gone for a minute there. Um, pretty cool card, not gonna lie, that's cool. Alright, so here is the pin, it just says limited release, so... It does not have a, uh, it's not one of the lower end ones, but still very small. Oh, it's sideways. All right. One, two, three. Star Trek. Okay. Uh, that's the, uh, Enterprise. This is about as far as my knowledge of Star Trek goes. Uh, there is no number on the back there. Um, but yes, I believe... I could be 100% wrong, but this is the Enterprise? Maybe? Star Trek! Star Trek. And then the, oh yeah, the symbol. That's there too. Um, not bad. I mean, again, I, I don't hate Star Trek. I just don't follow it enough to really, uh, realistically give a whole lot about it. Um... Will I keep this pin? That is up in the air. Uh, cause... 
my fiance, I believe, does like Star Trek a little bit. So, all right. Uh, what is this? That is the Beckett COA. So, what is this? Oh, so this is the prop replica. So it's Dwight from The Office. I know that one. All right, that's pretty cool. Um, I was honestly half expecting the auto to be from The Office, but it is not. But still, pretty cool prop right there. Um, oh, and that can slide. I'm trying to keep it in the plastic because I'm not probably going to keep this. But the uh, nameplate can slide out so you can kind of put whatever in there so okay not bad that is the item so we're gonna go ahead and grab this next so hackers and spider-man um i'm just gonna assume the autograph is from hackers which i know absolutely nothing about so i'm gonna guess this is spider-man one two three i am correct that is totally spider-man um very cool comic sketch there pretty much um number what does that say 619 out of 2200 and there's the autograph uh huge spider-man fan um actually currently playing the uh miles morales game right now on the ps5 loving it um uh, yeah i like spider-man I'm, I'm, I'm keeping this um not bad all right so then it comes down to the hacker's item I'm going to know absolutely nothing about this. I can already see what it is, too. So, uh, I'm not even going to show the Beckett COA because it's just clear what it is. Um, this, I guess, is a floppy disk. at and &T. IBM formatted. Uh, and this is signed by... I have no idea who. So, this is signed by... Ren Renale Santiago, which I have no idea who that is. Uh, they are from Hackers, Dangerous Minds, and Con Air. So for me, I have no idea what that is. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get into the uh, reveal card here. If I can grab it. Okay, so put that down here. <clears throat> There it is. And there it is. So, Bam Geek, February 2021. This month, we are featuring five franchises that have spanned the decades. Star Trek from the 60s, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from the 80s, Star Trek, or excuse me, Hackers from the 90s, and The Office from the 2000s. And of course, Spider-Man is ageless. Yes. We hope these bring you back to... Uh, we hope these bring you back no matter which decade you love the most. Okay. Uh, let's start off with the Shredder card. <clears throat> We're continuing our year of villains from all of our favorite franchises. This month, we present Shredder from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, brought to you by artist Othel Flowers. Look for the limited edition holo card. Yep. Then we got the prop item right here. Dwight. We have been waiting... A long time to feature one of our all-time favorite shows, The Office, in our box. We are excited to bring you these nameplates straight from Dwight's desk. Most of you will get Dwight T. Shrug? Yes, sure. And some will get Michael Scott. And I'll now reveal the stuff on the bottom here. So, there's the holo card, and there's the Michael Scott one. Next, Artist Alley. Spider-Man! Professional artist Carl... Carl Alstalletter? I'm so sorry, I'm butchering your name. Alstalletter? Whatever. Shows us his talent this month as his rendition of Spider-Man. Take a break with Spidey as he enjoys a sandwich and a stellar view. Also, some of you will get a limited edition night version of the print, where he is perched instead. I did not get that. Collector's pin from the series that launched a thousand more comes that launched a thousand more comes a special pin to commemorate exploring the final frontier. These pins are these pins celebrate the original Star Trek series and interpret Starship Enterprise. Hey, I was right. 
Most will get the Enterprise pin, while others get a Khan pin of 250. Khan! That's what it says. And there's also a limited run of Kirk pins of 99 and a black and white Kirk pin of 50. So that would be those down below there. Finally, the celebrity autograph. This. Also, I didn't show that, so that. Um, before the internet was a thing, we saw a glimpse of the future in the 1995 classic movie Hackers. I've actually never seen it. Uh, if it was the first movie to make computers cool and true introduced us to the idea that someday we could order pizza directly from our PC. You can do that? We are excited to have one of the main hackers. It looks like Freak, but with a PH. So Freak, I'm going to assume. Played by Rinoli Santiago in our box this month. Rinoli signed a 3.5 floppy disk just like the ones used in the movie 26 years ago. And that is that. So, ranking system. Wow, okay. Um, at number five, this is going to seem really out there. This is my number five. Not that I don't like the concept. It's, it's a floppy disk. Now, that's funny for me. For you kids that don't know what a floppy disk is, this is what you needed to save information on before a USB or the cloud. For us adults, we know what these are. Don't put a magnet to this. It won't work. Anyways, this is number five. Um, I just never seen the movie, and I've actually never heard of the actor before, so I just show little to no interest in this item to the point where this is going to be on the T-Series Showcase eBay page. Link in the description below. Uh, number four, I'm going to give it to the Shredder card. Uh, this is actually really well done to the point where I actually am probably going to keep this one. I am huge into villains. Um, no matter where they're from, they can be, uh, just in general. Like, these are three of the villain cards from this month, and I'm keeping almost all the villain cards from this month, so. Um, Disney villains. Love Disney villains. Uh, number three, I'm going to give it to this right here. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's just, you know, a nameplate. Um, and I don't... I've only watched The Office a little bit. I never really sat down and watched all of it. And realistically, I only ever watched it when I was down in Florida with my roommates. So, yeah, that's really about it. At number two, I'm going to give it to the Enterprise pin. This thing was cool. Um, I might keep it. I might not. I like pins. It's just I'm not huge into Star Trek. But again, my fiance is. So number one, I'm giving to the Spider-Man print. I love my boy Spider-Man, and this is really cool. Um, and yeah, an art print's number one. Ha, <laughs> just kidding. Secret number one is actually this thing I won. <laughs> All right, that's enough gloating on that one. All right, guys, that is it for the BAM box. Now. If you like this video, please, please, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, ring that notification bell, that no, no, blah, 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 whenever I post a new video. Uh, when you comment below and subscribe, oh, excuse me, when you subscribe, make sure you comment below what your favorite item in here was. Um, because that gets you entered into the 100 subscriber giveaway to win a $25 Amazon e gift card, which I'm extending out a little past 100 subscribers just so that way these videos can get posted. Once I get to 100 subscribers and all four of these videos have been posted is when I'll do the drawing, which I'll do during a video. Um, as I said, in the description below, you will see various things like the Bambox, Zobi, yada yada. You'll see the T-Series Showcase eBay page where some of the stuff like this, this possibly, um, will be up for sale because that's where I put all my things. you also see the T-Series collectibles ebay page that's my personal business where i sell tons of things like dice yes i got tons of these dice serious dice um when i say a ton i mean like hold on ready all kinds of different colors rainbow stars in you know red white and blue and i don't know if it's going to show that well but we're gonna as i drop stuff we're going to hit this thing with a black light. I haven't got stuff that glows in the dark. Those dice are awesome. 
Guys, if you want to get some of these dice, head over to the T-Series Collectibles eBay page to buy these. I have, I think, over 40 sets of dice at this point. I get them in all the time. Um, so check those out. And other items there as well. Without further ado, guys, that is the end of this one. This is the last of the official core boxes for BAM for this month of February. So can't wait to see you guys in March for the next ones and potentially that Ultra Box in there too. Have a good one, guys.